Hey guys, this is Garis and welcome back to another episode of Survival Done. We are back in the mission of Man on a Mission. And we are here in a Pridwin going to speak to Proctor somebody. It's quick <laughs> the Proctors make me Quinlan. Makes me confused. So we found out that Paladin Dance is actually a Sith and he's in hiding and we need to go find him. I'm still not sure what we're gonna do when once we can uh, once we confront him, if we're gonna... Proctor Quinlan tells me you're responsible for restoring Liberty Prime. Superb work. But you're here for medical attention. What can I do? Uh, I'm still not sure what we're gonna do once we confront him. But I have a feeling not to... We're gonna try and save him. I'm not sure if we're gonna reach Paladin status. Maybe we should save it and is the buffs depending on how long it takes so let's talk to this guy oh night I was told you were coming sorry about this business with dance what do you know about this situation while I was decrypting all of the data you acquired from within the Institute I came across a list it appears that the Institute keeps exemplary records where their synths are concerned including logging those that were reported missing. As I was perusing this list, I came across an image of Dance under the heading M797. A quick DNA comparison with our own records told the rest of the tale. I'm certain this comes as quite a shock to you, Knight. I'm sorry. I don't need apologies. I need to know where he is. Yes, you're quite right. I've been poring over Dance's duty reports, and unfortunately, I haven't found any concrete information. As you're well aware, Dance had intimate knowledge of the Commonwealth, and I'm afraid he could be seeking refuge anywhere. I think our best approach would be to identify every location he's ever visited, and eliminate them as possibilities one by one. Uh, that's what you may want to get comfortable. This could take quite a bit of... What the hell is this crap about Dance being a synth? I assume your outburst was a reference to some doubt regarding Dance's identity. I can assure you that my findings are quite accurate, Scribe. So he sets Dance up, and then you knock him down. Is that it? Um... How did you hear about it? There are no secrets in the Brotherhood. Maxon's made it clear that we're to locate Paladin Dance, and if we find him... Report his location to you. That can only mean you've been sent to hunt him down. I don't have time to discuss it right now, Halen. Why? In too much of a rush to pull the trigger? I can't believe that after everything Paladin and Dance did for you, you're just gonna turn your back on him like this. There's obviously been a mistake, and we need to get to the bottom of it. Scribe Halen! You're addressing a senior officer, and you will show him the respect that he's due. Oh, so help me, I'll have you brought up on charges. Now, unless you're here with information that can assist us, I suggest you return to the police station immediately. Of course. My apologies, Proctor. I believe I have some information that's relevant to the search. Very well then. Would you care to enlighten us? Or do we have to wait until you decide to grace us with your knowledge? She Knight, was... if you'd accompany me to the flight deck, I'd like to show you the information I've compiled firsthand. I've stored the data on my Vertiberg gunship's computer. At this point, I'll take all the help I can get. Very good, sir. Proceed, Knight. I'll continue doing my research here. If you'll follow me, sir. Yeah, I'm not too fond of the whole sir thing from her. But in any case, it doesn't matter. Okay, so two more loading screens. Oh, wait. Where are we going? Where is she going? And there's a Kolo Quantum dude. Maybe I shouldn't walk too close to her. Excuse me, Scribe Halen. Do you actually plan on killing Paladin Dance? Not really. 
I haven't decided yet. Well, before you do, I need you to listen to what I have to say. I've known Paladin Dance ever since I was an initiate. He trained me, showed me the ropes, and when I screwed up, he taught me to dust myself off and move on. He's earned my admiration, my respect, and my friendship. I don't care what Quinlan's report says. I don't care if he's a machine or not. He still dance. That's a bold statement. It's more than just a statement. It's a plea. Dance is the most selfless person I've ever met. I've watched him risk his own life based on nothing more than principle alone. That's why I'm asking you, not just as a member of the Brotherhood, but as a human being, give him a chance. Let him tell his side of the story. If you're not convinced by what he says, or somehow he's become truly lost to us, then you do what you have to do. Uh, all right, I'll hear him out. That's all that I ask. I'll just have to trust that when the time comes, you'll do the right thing. Before the Pribwin showed up, Dance had me identify a fallback point if we ever lost the police station. It was Listening Post Bravo, an old pre-war U.S. military outpost on the northern frontier of the Commonwealth. It's isolated, and we're the only ones that knew about it. So, there's a good chance that's where he's headed. Just be careful. There's no telling what state of mind he's in right now, or if he trusts any of us at all. Okay, so... At least she gave us inf good information. Um, so I'll hit there quickly. Um, there's probably going to be a saving screen again. Save and load screen. Uh, that we need to get rid of. And also, yeah, I'm still not sure what to do. I think I'm going to let him live. So let's first... If Elder Max in order me to follow him to the gates of hell, I'd be the first one to kick them open. I think I'll, as I said, leave him alive. So the first option we'll do is kill him first and see what the, the um, turnout is. And then we load a save and we don't kill him. And then, well, we keep with that. Because as I said, Nick Valentine is also good. And he's not under the control of the institute anymore. So it's an institute that we ate. Not necessarily their creation. If their creation follows their orders of kidnapping and killing, then then we destroy it. So let me quickly pass these two save points and I'll meet you at the end point. Okay, I've quick traveled to the Medford um, Memorial Hospital because it's the closest to where we need to go. Um, Travel to Listening Post Bravo. So we need to go there. So it's behind us. The sims are around, but unfortunately, sims are friendly to us at this stage. So let's hope they keep that way for now. Ooh, there's a repair station. I think it's actually good that we. <laughs> Repair some of our stuff quickly. It's been a while since I've repaired it. Um. Okay, let's quickly see. Ooh, yeah, <laughs> we definitely need to uh, repair. T. You see, so you can do a man on a mission. Oh, we don't have any more items. If you add it on you, you can repair it, no problem. But what I'll do, I'll travel to Sanctuary after this episode and go repair it because I've got all my resources over there. But again, you can keep it on you if you find it. If you Spend more time 
I'm disassembling all your junk. Like this, it gives you gear, screws, spring, and aluminium. So what do I need, actually? Oh, well, I'm not going to worry for that, about that now. Our mission is to get to Listening Post Bravo. actually not too bad because we should be close already Ooh, what's that since the um, building it in the oh goodness gracious why do we have that if it's useless Um, in the compass where the building is already picking up so that tells me we aren't too far ahead well we can open the map as well oh, we actually f a better ways there is a bridge run what happened here? settler why is the settler killed? Oh, glowing one. Makes sense. And a raider. Now it doesn't make any sense anymore. A settler, a raider, and a glowing one. Went into a bar. I don't know where is that joke though. <laughs> Maybe it's that. There. There's so much to explore in this world. And fortunately we do not have time for everything in a, in this um, I don't know, mission playthrough. Maybe if you guys enjoyed this and want me to, I can do a normal playthrough and do it differently, choose a different side maybe anything so just let me know if you guys enjoyed this and if you would want to see another type of series also containing fallout 4 not fallout 76 i definitely not gonna take that i'm not playing that at all i'm not gonna waste my time 76. It's pointless. Oh wow, they're actually tough. Sure, then we should be more, more um, defenses than that. He is a army guy, after all. Even though, oh. At least we get some loot. What's this? Advance. Well, obviously. Do we have a point? No. Okay, so another learning incoming. Or maybe not. It's elevator. Let's do a big save. 
right here. So I want to do a second one just in case I mess up that this one. There we go. Okay, first one we killed Paladin. Unfortunately. And then we'll save it to see the outcome. And then we will load one of these saves. And not kill him and see the outcome. Commencing ah. lawful use of deadly force. How did I locate Palo? Ah. Wow. Oh, does those things explode? Oh, he's out of his power armor. Interesting. I didn't know those things exploded. Oh, at least we find some steel. So, if we would want to, we can um, repair our power armor. Great mint, that's, that's really rare in this game. Now it's always okay. So first of all, we're gonna kill him. Let's see what he has to say. Ooh. I'm not surprised Maxon sent you. He never liked to do the dirty work himself. Should have told me why didn't you? Why didn't you tell me, Dance? Because I didn't know. Until Quinlan got that list decoded. I thought synths were the enemy. I never expected to hear that I was one of them. If it wasn't for Halen, we wouldn't even be having this conversation. So, what are your orders? Does Maxon even want me alive? Uh Ignorance of identity, since... Of course not. Since are the enemy, remember? All too well. Look, I'm not blind to the fact that this must be difficult for you. I wish Maxon had sent someone else. But that doesn't change a thing. I'm a synth, which means I need to be destroyed. If you disobey your orders, you're not only betraying Maxon. You're betraying the Brotherhood of Steel and everything it stands for. Synths can't be trusted. Machines were never meant to make their own decisions. They need to be controlled. Technology that's run amok is what brought the entire world to its knees, and humanity to the brink of extinction. I need to be the example, not the exception. Uh, why did you run? Yes. If you really feel that way, why did you run in the first place? The moment I learned the truth, I knew my life was in danger. I'm a soldier. So self-preservation kicked in. I needed to regroup and assess the situation. Once I got here, and I had some time to think, I realized I'd just made everything worse. I should have stayed on the Pridwin and accepted the inevitable. Like I said, I need to be the example, not the exception. I see you've calculated all the variables, just like a machine. Your anger simply proves my point. I'm not angry. I'm ready to accept the consequences of my true identity. Maxon's ordered you to execute me, and I'll be damned if I'm going to stand in your way. If it needs to be done, then so be it. I've never been prouder of you than I am right now, brother. It's been a pleasure serving with you. Why does he walk away? I'm sorry. Oh, yeah, actually goes on his knees and all. Oh, goodness. Didn't like doing that, though. Fusion core. And there's a synth component. Oh, goodness. A grape mint, that's... Oh, great. Okay, so let's 
find out what the end result is of doing this. I don't think I'm gonna keep this. So let's just not loot. Why waste all the time in loot if we're not gonna keep this safe? Did we have an option? Data, Prime Patrol. Let's see quickly. Going up. Wonder where that weird <laughs> elevator music is. This is as bad as loading screen. Maybe I should skip it. Ground floor. Okay, so let's fast travel. Back to Pridwin and I will pause the recording again. Okay, we're back here. Actually, I should have just loaded in there. So to save time, I'll I run. Suspected there was something weird. Okay, and there is Max and let's hear what he has to say. Report, Knight. Have you handled the situation with Paladin Dance? Hey. Do you want his hollow tags as proof? That won't be necessary. Perhaps you should keep them as a reminder of your lapse in vigilance. Of course. Dance's execution creates a missing link in our chain of command. That traitor held quite an important position with us. I'm certain that you'll make a fine replacement. His quarters and all his possessions are now yours. Including his personal suit of power armor. Oh. Congratulations, Paladin. Uh, not even gold. Went, let's, went I won't sport. disappoint you, Elder. Had I even a single doubt in my mind, I wouldn't have awarded you the promotion. Just be aware that a Brotherhood Paladin is expected to be a symbol of integrity to our brothers and sisters. I trust you won't disappoint them. Or disappoint me. In any event, we still have the Institute to contend with, and a lot of work to do before we can begin our final assault. I While the know. finishing touches are being put onto Liberty Prime, Captain Kells has identified a potential threat to our operations. Report to him immediately for your next assignment. Ad Victorium, Paladin. Okay, let's quickly... Element Alpha at 93%. Compensating. Go down. Eternal monitoring. Attention! Bravo 6-4, report to Armor Bay right 2. Now. Bravo 6-4 to Armor Bay 2. Okay, this door was always locked, so now we can enter it. I, I, I'm assuming it will be Paladin Dance's quarters, so I just want to check out how the power armor looks in in conjunction with the uh, ones we currently have. Okay, that was a quick load at least. Where's the power armor? Fusion cell. Let's see what we can get if we take this route. Bottle cap, bottle cap. It's a quick rundown, so you guys also know if you decide to go this route. Oh, we have fusion cores. So if you're running really low on fusion cores, you can do this. Okay, so I just want to see how the power armor is, as I said earlier. Just want to see if it's worth it. Worth a betrayal. Okay, this load is longer. Okay, not that much time. Attention! This is a reminder. All recovered technology must be presented immediately to Proctor Quinlan for evaluation. Anyone found in possession of undocumented technologies will be subject to inquiry and punishment. Guessing it could be this one. I'm pleased to see Maxence promoted you to Paladin. You deserve it, brother. Okay, so where's the power on that? Oh, here it could be this. Oh, look at the power armor. It's a 60D. What do, I ha do we have now? 60B, 60D. Oh, it's quite much stronger. Have you ever fired a minigun? 
Choose through ferals like paper. Okay, so cool. We have a D. Let's see how much armor it gives. 155. Or is it also? 620. I believe the other one is just 40. Ah, oh, 500. Okay, so the, the power armor is really worth it, it seems. And we get four fusion, five fusion cores because there's one inside. So you guys can really decide to do this if you want. Choose this option. Rest is the same. So let's quickly load that save game. And decide not to kill paladins. Paladin. Dance. Paladins. What did I just say? Quick save. It seems it's the one closest. So I'll see you there. Okay. So as I said, we're going to try and go with an alternate way. I'm not surprised Maxon sent you. He never liked to do the dirty work himself. Uh, you should have told me. I wish you would have told me the truth, Dance. I might have, if I'd known what I was. Until Quinlan got that list decoded. I thought synths were the enemy. I never expected to hear that I was one of them. If it wasn't for Halen, we wouldn't even be having this conversation. So, what are your orders? Does Maxon even want me alive? No, something a way out. No, but I'm hoping there's a way out. Don't be ridiculous. Look, I'm not blind to the fact that this must be difficult for you. I wish Maxon had sent someone else, but that doesn't change a thing. I'm a synth, which means I need to be destroyed. If you disobey your orders, you're not only betraying Maxon, you're betraying the Brotherhood of Steel and everything it stands for. Synths can't be trusted. Machines were never meant to make their own decisions. They need to be controlled. Technology that's run amok is what brought the entire world to its knees, and humanity to the brink of extinction. I need to be the example, not the exception. Uh, what? I'm not sure. You're human. He's not really human, but he is a machine. I can't tell if that's the human or the machine talking. The fact that you're confused only strengthens my decision. I'm ready to accept the consequences of my true identity. Maxon's ordered you to execute me, and I'll be damned if I'm going to stand in your way. Mm. No. I won't do it, Dance. I can't believe you'd risk your life just to keep me alive. Why would you do that for me? Oh, I can't do anything. I've already lost my family. I don't want to lose my friend. Well then, I'm sorry to disappoint you. I don't wish to debate this any longer. You've sworn an oath to destroy the Institute and every synth that you find. No exceptions. Consider this your greatest test, Knight. Do you have what it takes to get the job done? No, I won't. <coughs> what the hell are you waiting for? This doesn't seem right. It doesn't matter. Don't let your feelings about me cloud your judgment. This decision is bigger than both of us. It's about the future of the Brotherhood. We must stay on mission, no matter the cost. Now, do it. I can't do it, Dance. It's not right. I can't believe you'd risk your life just to keep me alive. What's changed your mind? What do you mean, risk my life? If Maxon learns that you've disobeyed a direct order to save the life of a synth, he'd have you executed. Why would you risk that for me? I can't convince him. Do I maybe have a point? I've already lost my family. I don't want to lose my friend. Well then, I'm sorry to disappoint you. I don't wish to debate this. Do I have a point in... Ah, shucks. Ah. I'm warning you. If you leave here without following your orders, I'll be forced to carry them out. Is that what you want? Okay, so I can't convince him in this playthrough, so... 
Uh, guess we'll just have to go with, through with it. I'm sorry guys, I didn't want to do that. So let's load the save game on the Pridwin. Uh, let's just do it, why not? Pridwin quarters. Okay, so we're back in Paladin Dance's quarters and we're gonna loot all the things that we can. Well, not all the things, but a few things and the fusion cores definitely. Uh, I really didn't want to kill Paladin's Palad Paladin Dance, but it seems like we didn't have any other option. Uh, I didn't want to do that! Well, actually, it's more of a um, dilemma if you actually played with him as your companion and he tells you the story and everything he, he did and um, accomplished. But yes, as I said, he's proud, proud of us for doing that. Why is there a dog ball with me? Attention! Any soldiers who have not yet received the field assignment from Proctor Teagan should speak to him at once. That is all. Okay, but fortunately we do get a nice Your promotion was well deserved, Paladin. set of power armor. Okay, that one is still red as well. This one. It's also red. Ah. I believe we got this one right in this bay, so let's keep it in this bay. <laughs> Taking a fusion core, thank you. And we're getting a new fusion core out of this one. And we're putting back the 73 in this one. With your reconnoiter of the Institute complete, we finally have first hand knowledge about their facility. You know what? We have looking this for ammunition or weapon mods. Dr. Tegan might have what you need. We have the modification that Proctor Ingram gave us. Where is that? No mod. So where is that mod? That oh, maybe it's in our mod list. Let's quickly check. Inventory mods. Mods. Medic pump. D60. Okay, so we can apply it to this uh, bow armor. Um, medic, so where is that one going? Not here. Left arm. Not there. Not there. Maybe it's a torso. Yes, there it goes. The tech seats during combat and automatically uses a stem pack when health is low. Okay, great. And it's model D and not B, so it's much more. Liberating the Commonwealth is a huge responsibility. Okay, guys, we'll I think we're calling done. it here t today. We got an awesome new power armor. We unfortunately had to get rid, rid of Paladin Dance for this power armor. But we are one step closer to ridding the. Commonwealth of this one. I'm reading the Commonwealth of the Institute. The so unfortunately, we had to do ended up scraping rust off of the Pridwin's hull. Nice. Um, so unfortunately, they had to start with Paladin Dance. That was a hectic decision to do, but unfortunately, it had to be done. So we will be heading to. Proctor or Captain Lance or Captain Kells to find out what's going on. So let's quickly go. I think let's go get our mission objective and we'll at least save a few times in a few minutes in the next episode. So let's go down. Okay. So we're <laughs> leaving power armor all, all over the Bredwin. So let's find out. 
Ah, Paladin. Good. Now that the unfortunate matter regarding Dance has been settled, we can return to our primary mission. Unfortunate matter. Do you think Dance's execution was justified? It's quite obvious Dance was a traitor. Or at the very least, a turncoat in the making. That machine's presence was endangering this ship and its crew. So it needed to be dealt with, swiftly and without mercy. Your actions in this matter were not only justified, they were vital to our mission. With all of that behind us, we can shift our focus back to our wartime preparations. Oh well. I'm ready, Captain. Good, because this mission demands your full attention. Now, before we launch our attack on the Institute, we need to address another threat. The Railroad. They're a small but capable group that uses subterfuge and guerrilla tactics to harass their enemies. Our tactical analysis says they could possibly hamper or harm our operations which is a risk I'm not willing to take. If we strike them now, we should be able to maximize the amount of damage we do to their organization. Not worth it. Uh, I didn't really want to take one with the Institute. Ah, oh, well, not the Institute, the Railroad. Fine, but it hardly seems worth our time. The Railroad may not appear to be a threat, but I can assure you they are a potential danger. Destroying the Railroad hinges on completely eliminating their leadership. Otherwise, they'll simply regroup somewhere else. To that end, here's a list of the five targets we believe would cause a catastrophic failure in their chain of command. No prisoners. Do they all have to die? Absolutely. It's the only effective way of ensuring that they're no longer a threat. Now, before you depart, Proctor Ingram has additional orders for you to complete. Our sources tell us that the railroad has some sort of experimental or prototype robot in their headquarters. They're calling it the Predictive Analytic Machine, or PAM for short. <laughs> Cute, huh? They use the robot for complex strategic calculations that are much more efficient than anything we can generate here. If you could use this holotape to decrypt the security on Pam's terminal, it will force the unit to return to the Pridwin. I'm certain we could put Pam's computing power to good use. Otherwise, destroy it. We wouldn't want it to fall into the Institute's hands. Um... I'm not really the hacking type. Then find someone who is and take them with you. I'd hate to see that robot go to waste just because you don't know a terminal from the rear end of a Brahmin. I hope I don't need to remind you that the acquisition of technology is one of our most sacred tenets. When you're ready, proceed to the Old North Church and link up with our assault team. They'll provide demolition support and all the firepower you'll need to take the railroad down. Add Victorium, Paladin. If you're no good at hacking Pam's systems, you should take someone with you who can. Okay, so that means we must to minimize take reactor peak. jitter, adjusting compression rate. He's the only one that can. keeping maintained. Thrusters stable. Ah, cool. I <laughs> already failed. Nice. Okay, so we have our mission for our next episode, guys. I'm not sure if we can take um, Nick Fury or or do it on our own. Um. I'll think about it after this episode and I will talk to you guys when we're back. But I'll meet you at the North Old North Church in the next episode. So with that I'm gonna end the episode. But before that, please remember to subscribe guys if you haven't done so already. And please leave a like or a dislike and if you decide to on a dislike Please comment why so that I can work on my um, content for you guys in the future, especially so it is more interesting for everybody. And so with that, I'm leaving you till the next one guys, so I will see you then. Cheers!